doesn't exist. Or it's never been dumped. Okay, we're re-rolling it. <clears throat> that is a pretty great box art. You're not wrong, Jessica. Tribulations. This also does not exist on Game Facts, okay? Game name starts with Troll. Trolls and Tribulations. Alright, this is on Game Base 64. This is an actual game. This looks kind of like the original Mario Brothers almost. High score saver. Okay, I think this might be just like a score attack game. Made by Jimmy Huey, who did the programming, the graphics, and the music. He did all of it. Okay. Interesting. Ba -bum 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 -ba -dum -ba. Yay, we got a download link for this. Good. Good, good, good. It's an action game set in an arcade platform and puzzle element themes. It was also released for the Atari 8-bit and Apple II. <clears throat> yeah, for score attack, if there's a leaderboard, it's try to beat the high score. Uh, otherwise, we just play it until we're sick of it, I guess. <laughs> Which probably won't take too, too long. Uh, Trials and Tribulations, is there a manual for this anywhere? Computer Game Museum. Wow, Mokag has a page about this game. Wow. Crap. Let's look at the box art here. That's pretty good box art. I like that box art. Pretty good. Pretty good. And we got a manual. Save link as. Boom. Okay. Let's check out the manual here. Page. All right. Best seller, creative software. Ancient treasures are hidden inside the caverns. The trolls have set out on an expedition through the dark dungeons, perilous peaks and rising waters to retrieve the valued relics. But watch out. These treacherous mazes are inhabited by troll-crunching cretins, hungry buzzards, ghastly skulls, and sinister spiders, all intent on keeping the treasures within the walls of their wicked world. Objective. Your job is to lead the trolls through the many underground mazes and recover the treasures that have been hidden there for centuries. Your success will depend on your skill combating the cretins and the wisdom with which you choose your path. You start the game with six trolls, but be careful. There are skulls and spiders lurking behind the cavern walls. You can end your expedition at any time. Control is joystick control. Fire button activates each troll when it first enters the maze. Once in action, pressing the fire button lets you jump in the direction you're facing. Okay. Pull towards you south to fire. Also to reload bullets. Push north to jump straight up. Right and left lets you move in either direction. F1, start the game. F3, freeze the screen. F5, turn off the music. Okay. Okay, playing the game. You will begin the game with six trolls. The number of trolls remaining is indicated by the troll heads located in the top left-hand corner of your screen, just below your score. In many but not all mazes, the first task you must accomplish is to shoot down eight cretins. The number remaining is displayed at the top center portion of the screen. After a cretin is shot, it will turn to an egg. You must then run and knock the egg off the plank and into the water before it can rehash. Each troll is equipped with a gun and eight bullets. You must use up all eight bullets before destroying eight cretins. 
Oh, if, sorry, if you use up all eight bullets before destroying eight cretins, you must return to the plank with the moving vertical black lines in the center of the screen. Pull the joystick down and your gun will be reloaded. After eight cretins have been destroyed, you can pass through the doors that lead to the maze with the hidden treasures. Okay. As you encounter more difficult mazes, the cretins will be accompanied by low-flying buzzards and bouncing skulls. These hazardous obstacles cannot be shot. You must jump over them by facing the enemy and pressing the fire button. Once inside the treasure maze, you will occasionally have your way obstructed by a blue door. These doors can be opened with keys that are hidden in the maze, along with treasures. The master door, located at the end of each maze, does not require a key for passage. The trampolines located throughout the mazes use the trampolines to increase your troll's jump height and to reach high ledges of the mazes. Each time a troll dies, the next troll starts the expedition from the beginning of the maze in process. You will lose a troll each time you run into a cretin, get smashed by a bouncy skull, sit on a poisonous spider, get snatched up by a hungry buzzard, or fall in the water. All six trolls have lost their lives, the game is over. It's a fire button to return the game. Yeah, kind of an interesting control scheme. Uh, but it's only up to jump straight up, at least. Jumping normally is a button. Okay, points can be collected many ways while traveling through the mazes. Destroying cretins, recovering hidden treasures, opening doors, and master doors will all increase your score. Once cretins been shot, you must run and knock the egg into the water. If the egg remains on the plank, within seconds the egg will hatch and you will not receive any points. The points awarded for destroying cretins depends on which plank you're shooting from. The bottom plank's worth 100. Per cretin, and the points double each time the troll climbs up to the next plank. Red cretins are worth 900 points and do not have to be knocked into the water. The treasures that you will search for increase in value as you travel deeper into the maze. However, if a troll dies during the excursion and is replaced by a neutral, the points awarded for recovered treasures start over at 100 points, continue to increase until the new maze is entered. Each time you open a blue door, you receive 100 points. Remember, you must pick up the key before going through the door. There are also points for Points scored for reaching the master doors located at the end of each maze. Points are awarded at random for finishing the maze ranging from 100 to 900. If you receive over 10,000 points, the high score screen will appear after the game is over. Use the joystick to change the letters, press the fire button, and the correct letter appears. Due to memory constraints, this high score is not written to disk. <laughs> okay, then why record it? Then press the fire button to begin again. Improve his, that score. As you get better and reach more advanced levels, you'll get into mazes in which keys or prizes appear to be impossible to attain without sacrificing a troll. This is never the case. All treasures and keys can be collected with very careful manipulation of a troll. Hint. Watch the self-running demo for one such maneuver on the trampoline. Press option key when loading on Atari 800XL only. Okay. 90 day limited warranty. 1985. Okay. Sounds simple enough to learn. Let me update my stream title here. I'm going to have family feud music in my head for like the next six years, aren't I? <laughs> okay. Uh, trolls and tribulations. 1985 C64. OGG. Game 3. Bam. All right. Where's game four? Game four. Game four, not three. We finished three. Game four. Boom. Okay. Cool. Stream updated. Game obtained. Let's do this. <clears throat> yeah, the 90 day warranty expired <laughs> 35 years ago. <laughs> Tribulations. Auto start. <clears throat> so it recommended we watch the rolling demo for for a hint. Nineteen eighty four, according to this. Knock eggs in the water, avoid skulls and buzzards. Enter door to reach next level. Pick up treasures. Extra man every five mazes. <laughs> oh, 
All the high scores are 10,000 points. Okay. Fair enough. <laughs> Let's see what we're getting into here. Oh, man. So, maybe you can't shoot the skulls? trick here. What? <laughs> Interesting. Okay. I don't know what that was trying to show me, but okay. Hold on, I gotta update the stream title of 1984. Bounce on it. All right. Move man to desired level. Level one. Whoa, what the? Whoa, okay. Find the door. Okay, so step one kill the Cretans, push the eggs in the water. There's a third one in there? What if they jump in the water themselves? I don't even know how to get up. Oh! God damn it. How do you... Like, if we wanted to get up to reload, how would we even get up there? So you have to go, like, here and then go over. Did we f get the key? I don't know. Okay. Do -do 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 -do. Oh. Good job. Fucking A+. Plus. One maze, too. Oh, what? I couldn't move. God damn it. Yeah, this seems fine. 
Especially for 1984. Game made by one dude. Yeah, it might be timed. I don't know. Okay, can't kill skulls. Jump through there. Oh, wrong button. <laughs> Having two different jump buttons is a little weird. It's a good question, Rich. Oh shit, I walked too far. Dang it. Alright, this is alright. <clears throat> this is this is not Dandare 2. This is this is a video game. Made by someone who wanted the people who played this video game to have fun. Yeah, I don't know if there's an end. It's, it seems like there's actual levels. Like I don't maybe there's maybe maybe it just loops. I don't know. I don't know if this is just score attack or not. Oh, there's two of them there. That seems almost like it's like spawning extra. Cretans at times, it's kind of weird. Our troll looks more like a little boy in a baseball cap. to jump and grab that last treasure, but the uh, the walking is a little sensitive. You played this before? That's cool. Oh, 
all levels through. So is, is there like an ending? We're trying to figure out what the win condition is going to be for this game. Like, is it a score attack game or is there is there an end screen to reach? That's too far. Oh. Shit. Start me all the way back here? God damn it. Oh, he went too far. The walking is so sensitive, you have to be really careful. Yeah, I, bro I broke the 10,000 high score at least. That. you'd get that last potion because you can't you can't like turn around without taking a step so i don't know how you would get that the commodore 64 is is a computer no cretins on this this maze Trolls and Tribulations player here, people. Ooh! <laughs> yeah, fuck that lamp. Fuck that lamp. I'm not going down there. <laughs> no way. No way. What? Oh, fuck. Oh, no. No! <laughs> it's not supposed to be skulls here. shoot them on the reload platform. You can't shoot when you're on the reload thing. Because <laughs> it's the same button for both. God damn it. Can I hear skulls? Oh shit! What am I doing? <laughs> God damn it. Cable over. It is a good game. I concur. This game is good. Good job. A plus. Uh, wrong button. But that's okay. Oh no! I still get used to the the weird two jump buttons. 
Rob oh god. <laughs> this run is fucked. This run is done. I regret nothing! Yes, if I played this on Request Rampage, I would have played this for five minutes and be like, yeah, it's alright, and never looked at it again. That's why that's why I wanted to stop doing the Request Rampage, because it was just a waste of time. That and all the the repeats. There was only like four people requesting games, so we kept seeing the same things over and over again. The SID ship in the C64 is pretty, pretty impressive little bit of kit. This isn't the best C64 song I've heard by far, but, but yeah, the stuff people have done with the, the SID ship is pretty wild. C64 produced crisp 32-bit CD quality audio. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and say probably not, Reg. <laughs> CDs didn't exist. and tribulations. God damn it. Keep spawning where I can't get at them. Out of here, Cretan. I wonder what the first video game was to have this as a jump noise. It's such a common noise for jumping in, in video games, but I wonder what the first game was. Kong? Maybe. Maybe Donkey Kong. Too far. Fuck. 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 
Oh, that hurts. We're right at the end. All because of the super sensitive walking. It's like you're on a grid, and if it reads like any movement past the grid, it just dies. So far, we haven't had any emulation issues. So far. We'll see what happens. Yeah, extra dudes are every five levels, so you don't really need to go out of your way to get points, but it's really the, the main objective of the game, so <laughs> if you're not getting a high score, it's not really much reason to play it. From what, from what I saw on the comments page where I got this, it, this game like loops every four levels, so after you've seen the four stages, you've seen presumably everything. This is 1984, so it's it's certainly pre Super Mario. I don't know if it's pre uh, Mario Bros. like the actual original. That I don't know. Get out of here. Oh, we need ammo. So how do we deal with the spiders? We haven't encountered these guys yet. Just jump it. Okay, fair enough. Boom, 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 boom. different. It's it's not looping yet. Yes, hey, Axa. We got we even got new music now. Okay, so you, you could jump through the roof. That's good to know. Okay. Oh, that's a nasty key. Jump.
trampoline bounce me that high? I will. No. Oops. Uh oh. Okay, no, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, there's there's a little little bit of tech you can like rebound off the wall and turn around. Oh, what's this? Level two. Oh, okay. Nice bonus man. So we I guess there's just three levels to clear, and you can pick which level you want to play on, so you don't have to do the old levels after you're done. We have a win condition. Oh, shit. God damn it. There's the red Cretans the manual was talking about. Okay. Oh, no, wrong button. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Jump. Oh, no, oh, no. Turn around! You son of a bitch! Whoops! I can't- I keep hitting the wrong goddamn buttons! This control scheme's still wigging me out. God damn it. Level two is stepping it up. Oh! <laughs> I don't need keys. That just gets me back that way. Oh, I went too far. Too many steps. Too many steps. I'm not getting going for that potion. Fuck that. Trap floors? Oh, that's evil. At least we can start on level two.
This is going real bad. This is going real bad. Holy fuck. I have no lives left for the actual maze. Goddamn buzzards, get out of here. Oh, fuck! That's bad. This whole run has been awful. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Come on! Hey, Okagar, okay, did I know Legends were born in 1984? No, I did not. Oversensitive walk aid. God damn it. Okay, that was terrible. We can do way better than that. Sixty four. I'll pass. I have I have a text adventure rule for the gauntlet. Any text adventure comes up, it gets fucking turfed immediately. For free. No penalty. That that in sports management games. these dumb things. Come on. Get over here. Oh no, the buzzard. The buzzard. The buzzard. The buzzard. Oh. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I don't know why that buzzard turned away, but thank you, buzzard. Thank you. Fucking jump. Okay. What am I doing? I don't care about points. Stop. Our objective is no longer points. Our objective is to survive. This insanity. 
Oh no! <laughs> okay, there is no visual indicator that this floor fucking collapses. That's some horse shit right there. I guess it's the only way to get down. I oh, went two steps! You were supposed to go one step! One step! No! Fuck! Fuck! What's with all the extra keys? Oh, 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 you son of a bitch. <laughs> you son of a bitch. <laughs> Motherfucker. <gasps> oh no, I can't turn around. Oh, you. Oh, I just learned new tech. You could do a standing turn jump. This game has tech. Did you see that shit? There's tech. Jesus, Jesus! Oh, I'm out of bullets! Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! <laughs> no! Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God! Oh, shh! I got some water. I'll be right back. Fucking water lid just went into the Bermuda Triangle or something. What the hell? <laughs> the Wendigo took it as he did. Oh, what? Come oh, on. Come on! I'm calling horse shit on that. Oh, there's two. Oh, 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 hey, buzzard. Whoa, 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 where are you going? Oh, no! Oh, come on! I hit, I hit the fire button.
Yeah. <laughs> we got that standing turn jump tech now. Satisfying. Satisfying tech. Yeah, this... this The thing that makes this fun is that it's fair. The only kind of horse shitty thing is, is when this happens, you take two steps off one tap of the movement. The movement's a little too sensitive. But other than that, like, the game is, is well balanced. It's good. Oh, we didn't do the. Oh, you. Tech failed me. No, GPA is not on there. If the gauntlet's successful and you guys are into it, after we're done, we can always do another, another gauntlet with a different set of platforms. I know some people really want me to do like Atari. Oh no, no. Turn jump's tricky. It isn't a given. God damn it. But yeah, I know people want to do like Atari ST and stuff, so. The great thing about the gauntlet is I don't have to think of things to play. Like, having streamed 300 and sub odd friggin' games, it's getting really hard to think of something to play. No, he, why are you not jumping? Fuck! So the fact that it's taken out of my hands and I don't have to think about it is great. Oh, in terms of the available machines, there's no Mac? Really? I haven't actually looked at what's on there. Oh yeah. Interesting. Atari ST isn't on there either. But the thing is, is one of the nice things is that the uh, the lists it uses for the systems are just text files, so I can go and change. I could change like Wonder Swan into Mac or Atari ST or whatever, and just manually put in my own list of games in there. <clears throat> so it w it wouldn't be hard to to change it. Plus, I think you, there's an option to add systems too, isn't there? You don't even have to do that. You can just add your own manually. Oh, shit. Okay, add bullets. Reload. Fire. Reload. Jump. Oh, God. Shit. <laughs> ah, Dyra. All right, we only lost one life on that. That's that's a step up. Nope. <laughs> oh, I hate that. I hate that.
hitting the wrong button there, and I don't know why my brain won't fucking register this properly. <coughs> Excuse me. Yes! Ah! Alright. That's the best we've done on that level. We're getting there. We're getting it. We gotta get through five levels, though. This set of lives. Oh no, 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 no! Fuck! <laughs> These stages are so hard with the buzzards now, man. Aw. Oh. This is the best I've done so far. <laughs> wow. Wow. That was fucking pathetic. Situations where you're just... Oh, come on! I hit the fire button. What? Well, this run's lost. We'll just die here. We gotta try and get through this fucking screen without dying. I don't even want to know what level 3 is like now. Add bullets! Thank you for the follow.
Okay. Dun 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 do 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 dun. Yay, new song. Oh, spread guys. God damn. How are we gonna get through five levels of this without running out of lives? Huh. With great fucking difficulty, apparently. Oh, 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 oh. This is ridiculous. Oh, what, I'm alive? I'm alive. I'm alive. What the buzzer turned around? What? What the fuck was that? Come on! You son of a bitch! That was nonsense. Well, now I have no lives for the next section. Okay, we gotta do the turn jump. No, that was not the turn jump! Oh no. Okay, we can still we can do this, we're fine. It's so hard to do. God damn it. for one more run today. these buzzards. It'd be so much better if you could kill them. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Why did you go left? Just jump straight up and back down, okay? Oh. Wow. Wow. Just, just die. Just die. I like the maze stages a lot more than I like these weird Mario Brothers stages or whatever you want to call these. Maze, the maze stages are more fun. Oh. all the skill I've accumulated in that game up to now. All right, that's it for today. <laughs> Thanks everybody for coming by. Uh, so how, how you guys like the gauntlet so far? Thumbs up, thumbs down. Do you like it? Do you not like it? Hopefully you guys like it. Uh, but yeah. Let's uh, throw somebody's way here.
We'll, we'll be doing more, more, more of it tomorrow, Mac Apple. Don't worry. We'll get that game done. I'm sure. Uh, anybody streaming anything cool? Uh, Cartube is playing Tomb Raider: Angel of Darkness. You know, I've never actually seen this game. I've just heard horror stories about how bad it is. Let's go check it out. All right, everybody. See you later. Have yourselves a great day.